when spring arrives in the redwood forest, it comes alive with many beautiful wildflowers. Milkmaids, redwood violets, prickly California wild roses, and the delicate trillium brighten the forest for all to see. Often overlooked is a lovely little ruby red flower hidden away among catkins on the bare branches of the California hazel. A little bump or a strong breeze carries pollen from the catkins to the flower, which is soon transformed into a plump little nut covered in a bristly wrapper. Before long, western gray squirrels are using all their acrobatic skills to comb the shrubs for their rich, delicious nuts. The squirrel's strong teeth make short work of the little nut's shell. Stellar's jays also have a fondness for hazelnuts. They don't have such an easy time cracking the nut's shell, but they've developed an ingenious way of dealing with the problem. After stabbing at it for a while with no luck, they swallow it part way down to soften it, and then bring it back up to stab at it some more. Migrating Townsend's warblers occasionally make a short stop on their travels to hunt for bugs on the leaves. As the hazelnut casing begins to dry out, next year's catkins have already begun to form. In autumn, the deciduous hazel leaves turn yellow and begin to fall. Winter rains soon follow, and the cycle begins again.